Hi, hey, right, today we're doing something a wee bit different again. Um, I'm mucking about a wee bit with the Raspberry Pi 5. Um, I've had this to work in the past, but it doesn't seem to work now. Uh, this was trying to get 405 lines from the Raspberry Pi 5 um, onto my Sony 990. Uh, what we're using is a, a modulator and if we get 405 we just press the two buttons in uh, it turns the time base but still allows us to go through UHF tuner etc etc I don't have a, a modulator at this time for a uh, band 1, band 3 etc so I've got to do that now <laughs> this is quite interesting we've done this is the very latest version of the Raspberry Pi operating system Bullseye I believe uh, 64 bit blah 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 which is now supposed to have all the uh, uh, the requirements for 405 now um, what I did initially was I put on the um, a uh, the, the, the TV I disconnected the uh, um, the, the HDMI screen here this uh, touch screen also I uh, downloaded the um, uh, changed the, the Raspberry Pi config so that it would go to a uh, video output composite and that's why we've got this picture here so um, if we go to composite one uh, sorry it's blanking out uh, we go to you might not see this very well because uh, <laughs> there's another issue uh, that's showing up composite one frequency is 59.975 so it's actually not 625 it's probably 525 um, so no, it's definitely not at 60. If I go to resolution, uh, and it's given us uh, 704 by 432. Uh, so 720, I would think, would be um, probably, uh, well, it's not right, obviously, we can see that. Uh, it's still 625. I think it is 625, actually. Uh, because the frames, oh no, I don't know. I don't think it has changed the speed. No, it hasn't changed. I think we've still got that 60 hertz. Uh, if I go back to it, you maybe you'll see it by the uh, the blanking on the screen. I mean, it's <laughs> it's just the way everything is here. Unfortunately, you might not see very well. Uh, I've got the composite uh, frequency is 59. I'll go to resolution. We'll change it back to 720. Uh, oh, hang on a minute. It hasn't worked. For some reason, let's configure frequency resolution 720. Uh, uh, right, apply that. Uh, the frame speed is still the same, it's not changed the frame speed as far as I'm concerned. Um, just the different brightness levels, I think. Might be wrong there though, in saying that. No, I think I could be wrong. Um, right, we'll go back to screens again, we'll, we'll pick one of the other. Uh, Resolution settings. We'll, we'll go to 525.75. Apply that. Oh yeah, that has definitely changed the frame speed um, on there. So I'm going to OK that. So that's probably 625. To be honest with you, it's a bit wide. It's a bit wide. It's it's over over scanning it a bit. Um, but there's no 405 ones there as we can see. None whatsoever. Yeah, uh, the flicker is what I'd expect. So that's definitely uh, 625 lines rather than 525 lines. Uh, and it actually looks a bit better on the screen than 525 does. Yeah, yeah, it's definitely 625. Okay, so where has 405 gone? So the other thing we had to do was the uh, um, RPI update. Uh, I might get the number wrong here, it's from memory. Um, uh, pools 5867 or something like that. I think it's 5867. So we do that, but it only goes so far. Uh, and the rest of the program isn't there. So it doesn't work any longer, unfortunately. So I'm um, sad to say uh, all the hard work that's gone into this is no good. I cannot get 405, and that's what I was after. So I'm just going to revert this back to uh, HDMI and start using my screen again. So if somebody can come up with an answer, fine, but uh, it doesn't look to me right now that there is an answer to this. And it's a bit of a pity, because it did work. When I did have it working before, it worked really well, quite happy with it but uh, I had a, an SD card crash and uh, what happened that's it <laughs> yeah ah, just typical never mind okay thanks guys I'll put putting this on the uh, respective forum on the Goldborn forum 
uh, and you can see it from there and as you can see the flicker that's pretty normal that's what we get here and if I'd always had this problem over the years if I turn this what I might be able to do is if I reduce the brightness sometimes if you get the brightness right down and that it stops flickering there you go but you get all the reflections on for you can't win with this you cannot win with this I'm afraid um, you get another I need to turn the lights off in here and I'm not going to do it okay cheers guys thanks for watching bye